Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of React.js. So today we are going to learn how to create such a beautiful cross-sell in React. Okay, so let's see how we are going to build it. So let's, I have used the package. Those who haven't subscribed my channel, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like it. So I'm using this package that is this one, React multi cross -sell. Okay, and let's start the, with the code. So this is my cross -sell. Okay, this is crossl.js react multi -crossal. and this is the index file react multi uh, styles.css and this is a crossl that uh, we have added in our app part, right? And this is a crossl what we have added transformation container class we have added the item class if you want to add you can add infinite responsive we have added the breakpoints, okay? So you, uh, here you can see that you have crossl you can bypass the responsive parameter over here. Let me show you so here you can see that here you have responsive part right you can just copy this currently it's not responsive might be let's see so let's see and responsive ipad yeah it's responsive by default okay so it's uh, you can also uh, put over here responsive but here you need to bypass the responsive part from here responsive it's there there is a there is a thing that is responsive whole object you need to pass but here we have already passed all the parameter responsive you can see that so that's the reason responsive is there so no need to bypass over here okay now we have the autoplay speed arrows everything you can see that we need to study each and everything okay so here we have slides to slides three four two okay transition you want if you want to add you can container class you want to add remove arrow on the device tablet or you, this is a property you can remove that one device type you can get it the dot list class you want if you want to add and everything that they you want to show dots true or false you can show draggable true swipeable true autoplay infinite each in the property is there so it's a i think it's a best part that best one you should use for the if you have a requirement of the cross cell you can use this one okay and it, it's very easy nothing uh, worry about it just this is the crossal part that you can directly copy from here like this one this full crossal and here you need to define the items over here so you can see that in the crossal i have added this items over here in the dev 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 and adding the images you can add the image link hyperlink text anything that you want to add over the crossal you can add it okay easy so any doubt, any query in that, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.